So it smells good. Tell me what happened in the square behind the museum. Eight groups of Israeli youth from high school or in the memorial of the um, ghetto Warsaw uprising. How do you know it was eight groups? I count the yeah. teachers. Really? Yeah. Well, how come you counted them? <laughs> you can see them. Okay. Who is the teacher and who is not. <laughs> and we were making a footage and then you told me, okay, let's go. Yeah. So is it possible to film in collaboration station? Well, um, it's not possible. Why? Because of the security issues. Uh huh. So what what is dangerous in filming the train station? I really have no idea. <laughs> but I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea. Okay. How did you feel when you arrived at Warsawa Central Station? I felt unsafe uh -huh. because you just go into the train station, nobody is checking you up, you can do whatever you want, you can go even to the airport um, without nobody was checking you, who you are, uh, what you have in your luggage. Don't you think it's too much to check people's luggage, it's just train? Such a big uh, train station, it's not ne even necessary. You can even go to Berlin without checking you up. How do you feel? You just, you know, just travel, you're in the European Union and you can take whatever you want and live wherever you want and work wherever you want. And it's just, yeah, you have this feeling of freedom. I didn't really feel like we were in danger, actually. Because you don't know what it is <laughs> to be Israeli. I mean, I'm sorry, but yeah. I didn't feel like I'm in danger, but I felt like I should be careful. And if I can not be outside right now and be in the museum, which is the safest place around, I will be in the museum. 